Hola, hola. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I wanted to share something with you that is near and dear to my heart. And it is why I've been gone for a minute. <laughs> so I know you guys know that I was working on something I just couldn't tell you what at the time and now it has launched and it has been launched for almost two months now and I am so excited and I just want to share it with you so that you know what's going on and you know what's going on in my world so here we go all right so I recently launched my own makeup line uh, I've been in the makeup field for over eight years now and it was always a dream of mine to create my own line so I researched for a long long time and then um, went through the steps of making and creating my own line so my line is called Makeup by Angels just like my service business um, however it's Makeup by Angels Cosmetics and I created this line to inspire other women to be themselves, uh, bring out your inner beauty, and just let it shine on the outside. Makeup, to me, is an expression of who we are, our own creativity, our own inside, and however you want to express it in any way that you want to. Um, that's what I makeup does for me. Um, so, <laughs> that being said, I'll share with you guys my colors, my inspiration, and just everything behind the line that you want to know if you have any questions and exactly what each item is. I'm going to try to make this video as short as possible. Um, I'm not going to do swatches in this video, but I will give you swatches in the future, but I will show you the colors. And also there are swatches on my Instagram and um, there are some on my Facebook as well. And I think that's it. So the reason why I'm not going to do swatches of everything because it's a lot of product and it will take up a lot of your time, girl. A lot of your time. So anyway, one of my babies. Hopefully you guys can see this. So one of my babies are matte liquid lipsticks. Um, liquid lipsticks are one of the newest, hottest trends. And I just love them. I mean, they're a long lasting lipstick. They're one of the longest lasting lipsticks. So I created these matte liquid lipsticks as one of my staple products on my line. I have numerous of things. Um, I order lipstick, I offer, I offer lipsticks in uh, three different formulas. I offer liquid lipsticks in two different formulas. And I offer eyelashes and lip glosses. So my liquid lipsticks, they are a matte formulation. Uh, there's a matte and a cream. The one I'm going to show you right now is my matte formula. I am wearing it right now. So when working with my chemist, the way that I wanted to pretty much drop this line in the matte formula was I wanted something that was going to be long lasting for everybody. I Most of my business is bridal business, a lot of you guys know that, and I do brides every weekend, numerous, and bridal parties, and just special occasions. So when you're doing special occasion and bridal makeup, like the last thing you wanna do is keep touching up. So a lot of my brides, I'd be like, girl, you're gonna last all night. Most of my brides are like, I fell asleep and the next day my makeup was still on, but they always needed to touch up their lipstick. So I wanted something that was going to be super, super long lasting and one of the longest lasting on the market. So that is why my matte formula is super long lasting. Um, just keep in mind, I have it on right now and it's non-transferable. I can kiss somebody and it won't come off. So girl, if you're kissing a, your husband or anything, it's not going to transfer onto him, which I just love about that. If you eat something, it's going to break down in, in the center of your mouth, but you, you're just going to reapply that. But for the most part, it's going to be the longest lasting lipstick then that you can apply. Uh, I offer, wanted to be sure about that, 12 different shades in the matte liquid lipstick. You will need makeup remover to remove this product off of your lips. You need it. I do offer a makeup remover, uh, a small size travel one on my website so you can pick that up and you, I mean it a little bit goes a long way and it will take your liquid lipstick right off. So let's get straight into these colors. Okay. So they, I just launched my new spring because I launched my regular colors and then I launched my spring colors literally only 
a couple weeks after, maybe two weeks after because of the way that the launch happened. So I will show you guys my originals and then I'll just add on the spring colors to that as well. Although some of them can be worn in the spring. They're like all year round type of thing. Uh, so I have Conqueror, which Conqueror, hopefully you can see this. I'm going to try to bring them close to you. Conqueror is a deep red. And this is the packaging. It's got my little angel wings on it. Gold is my favorite color. Um, well, one of my favorite colors. I would say my second favorite color. So I wanted everything to be super glamorous and bright. So we went with gold. Um, now I do have a deep grape color, which is called Commandment. Now this is the deepest color that I carry on the line. That's Commandment. And then we go into our real pretty red, which is called Strength. It's a pretty much an everyday red. This red is so, so, so gorgeous, guys. Like you can literally wear this. This is like the perfect red. And I like love it. I like tested so many different colors before I went with that one and I was like in love with it. Um, the color that I have on my lips now is called Virtuous. Virtuous is more of a malfy, so it's kind of mixed with pink and brown and it has a hint of a little bit of plum in there. So you can see it on my lips right now. One of my favorite, favorite, favorite colors. I love her. Um, then I have Pure. You've probably seen Pure a lot in a lot of my pictures. Pure is more of a neutral flesh tone color. I hope it's not getting a glare and you guys can see the color. But once again, the, the swatches are on my uh, Instagram, so you can go there. That's Pure. Believe is so pretty for the springtime. How pretty is she? She is more of a bright pink. Gorgeous, gorgeous. And then I have Romans. Romans is a pretty purple color. So pretty. Now I have my Angelic, which is a very pretty pink. Then I have Dedication. Dedication is very nude. It's got almost like a brown undertone to it, but very nude. Goddess is a more of a pinky coral. Gorgeous for the spring, summertime. Hopefully you guys can see that color. Bear it all, it's just like the name. <laughs> it's very bare and flesh tone. It's got more of a peach undertone to it. But it is still a peachy nude. And then I have Loyalty, which is a coral. It's like a pretty orangey coral with a little bit of melon in it. And so those are all 12 of the liquid lipsticks. Uh, I do have a couple people asking me to put them in a bundle package on the website. So I will put them in the bundle package for you guys. So if you want to purchase all of them, you can, and can do that. I will make that available. Now my second ones I'm going to show you are my cream liquid lipsticks. The cream liquid lipsticks aren't as long wear as the matte liquid lipsticks. The matte are definitely um, the longest wearing on in my product line. The cream ones are a little bit more creamier and they go on as a liquid and dry into more of a cream. So you can definitely feel that when you have them on. So first I have Faith, which Faith is a pretty flesh tone but with a, like, a little coral undertone to it so it is there it is right there hopefully you can see it it's hard without doing the swatches but literally we will be here all day swatching <laughs> so i'll separate them in videos for you guys now glory is my pink she is your all-round pretty pink baby pink 
Then I have Trust. Trust is a really pretty purple color, but it's more of like a lilac. And then I have Pink Angel, which Pink Angel does offer metallics in it. So it is a cream when it dries down. However, it has like metallic, you could probably see it's got like silver metallics. So really pretty for frosted lips. If you like frosted lips, this is definitely gonna give you a frosted lip color. Now onto my glosses. I do offer the cream liquid lipsticks in a bundle pack so you can get them um, all together. And then the lip glosses. Um, I do offer these in a bundle pack as well. You can get all four in the bundle. So uh, my first one is Honesty. And Honesty has more, uh, it's flesh tone. A lot of my lip glosses are more of sheer tone. So they offer a little bit of color with a high gloss to them. So they're not um, like a full on lip color. They're more of a tint color with a gloss. So you can wear them individually or you can pair them with anything. So, you know, you can pair it. Now, Honesty is one of my faves because um, because I'm Latina, a lot of uh, glosses or things that they would say would be natural color on people. I have a natural color on my lips, so when I put certain things, it pales them out and it makes them look too light. So this was more of a flesh tone lip color for me that I love that I could just pop on and go and that's not gonna dry me out and make me look like pale as far as my lip color. It's not gonna um, wash me out, I would say is a better word. So Honesty has a little bit of color to it. It's really pretty. Now Truth is a very beige gloss. So it's really pretty for people who love their nudes and want to add that pop of beige in the center. And it also has um, little gold reflects in it. So that's awesome. I love gold reflects in anything. And my Eve is your all round neutral, soft pink, um, more of a, um, a very sheer gloss. So it kind of goes over anything you can pop with anything. It won't make your lips look lighter. It's a neutral color and it just um, kind of matches your natural color because it's so sheer. And then one of my big sellers, Wisdom. Wisdom is so, so, so gorgeous. It does have gold reflects in it as well, but it's more of a pink, a pinky, I would say a pinky nude. So because it is very sheer um, on. So those are my four glosses and now hopefully I can try to get to all of these and my lashes. So my lipsticks are here, ta -da, my babies. Um, I offer matte lipsticks which are right here and then I also offer pearl lipsticks which have a pearlescence to it, really pretty for people who like that extra pearl. Um, kind of iridescy in their lips as well. And then I offer a cream lipstick also. So I'll go over the colors with you guys. My hot seller for summertime uh, is the Spiritual, which has been selling like crazy. And uh, Spiritual is a pretty coral color. Very pretty for spring, summertime, gorgeous. Uh, Serenity is a pinky purple. She's very pretty. Now these are the matte colors that I'm going over with you. Now my matte aren't super drying at all, which is amazing because they're more of a creamy matte texture. So they go on a little more creamy and then they just have the finish of a matte so that they're not drying to your lips by any means. And then I do have Glory. Glory is a deep plum. Look how pretty she is. Oh, she's so gorgeous. She's so gorgeous. Uh, Balance is a very pretty pink. She's more of a berry pink. So she's a mixture between, um, I would say, she's a mixture between a pink and a plum. So she's definitely like almost like a true berry. Now I have Lust. Lust is my deeper red that I offer. 
so pretty. So if you like deeper reds, you'll like that one. If you like more of a ruby red, then you would love Ideal Woman. She is your all round pretty red. Now, of course, I had to offer a nude, which is Steadfast. Steadfast has more of a peachy undertone, so it's, um, it's almost like a freckle color, I would say. It's so, so, so pretty. And then I have Holy. Holy is more of a brown, and I would say it's more of a brownie nude. So those are my matte colors. Now I'm going to show you my pearl colors. So Miracle, you probably, if you follow me, I wear this one a lot, I love Miracle. She is a pearl and she's a pretty pink. It has a slight bit of a plum in it and um, I think she's just like such a pretty pink and the pearl essence that it has to it is just gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. And Submit is also another pink, but it's a deeper pink. It's more of a berry pink with the pearlescence to it. And almost like a, almost like a light, light, light red. I wouldn't even say it's red. It's more of a, a mixture of a pink and a red. So it just gives it that perfect combination. It's not too deep. It's not too light. Now, Glamour is my nude with a pearl essence to it. So I wear this one a lot too. She's so pretty. So she's a nude, but then she has the pearl to it also. So, I mean, you could pair with any liner and looks amazing. Now, Heaven is right here. Heaven is my very beige nude. That one is definitely a big seller as well. Grace is a really pretty baby pink. And Danasia is my really pretty baby purple and i love my baby purples in the summertime so she's so pretty as you can tell a lot of my names are very inspiring um and inspirational and i just hope to inspire and be an inspiration on to other women in just just being glamorous every day every day I'm just about being glamorous all the time. <laughs> so I also offer mink lashes. Um, we are a cruelty free line. So all of the items here are cruelty free. Um, so my mink lashes, when I say mink lashes, they are faux mink lashes, but they are made with the highest quality. So it's very different from a regular um, false lash or even lashes that say 100% real hair. These are actual um, mink lashes. So they're lighter weight, which I mean most of my brides and every special occasion I have them on today. Today I'm wearing um, Date with Destiny and these ones I feel like you can wear every day. Now the great thing about my lashes are most well, not mostly, all of them, um, you can have multiple, multiple, multiple uses out of them because they are a high grade mink. Um, they're a lot softer and a lot more flexible and they're just a lot more durable. So, uh, that being said, I offer three different kinds. I offer a regular mink um, and then I offer a luxury mink and then I offer a 3D mink. So the regular mink are one layer of mink, um, high grade mink. And then the luxury mink are just more of a double layer. So you have a fuller effect or they're fuller in the ends or they have a, some kind of fuller effect to it but they're still the high grade mink. Now the 3D mink are also a high grade mink and they offer a 3D effect. So the ones that I have on today I believe are my luxury. And so literally they're a, um, they're a double, pretty much doubled in the mink quality. And you can see that. So if I'm wearing the 3D, the 3D are really wispy. I mean, they go up, they go in the center, they go down, but all with the same grade. Some of them bunch up in the corner. Um, the regular mink you can wear 10 to 
uh, 12 times. The luxury mink you can wear up to 15 times and then the 3D mink are 20 to 25 wears. So I've even gotten more than 25 wears out of one of my pair. It's just about taking care of them, putting them right back in the box. I do give you a cute, cute little box to store them in. It does have a magnetic on them which is awesome and you can put them right back in the box when you're done and just store them gorgeously and as you can tell my whole line is baby pink and gold and the whole collection is called elegance has no boundaries so i do i'm a strong believer that elegance has no boundaries i mean you can be in jogging pants with heels and have lipstick on and be elegant i mean there's just no limitations on your limits as to everybody has a different perspective of elegance anyway so elegance has no boundaries to me was just about expressing what it, what makeup is and i believe that makeup is elegance and on so many different levels so i just wanted to share that with you guys and create something that i can share with the world and um, something from me that I worked very very hard on and I hope you love everything in the line and There will be a lot more things coming <laughs> I am working on a lot of other stuff as well, but this is the start of something great um, But these lashes right here. These are takeover so takeover is very um, soft in the front Still give they still give you a lot of length and then they are super thick in the corner so how cute oh they're so cute they're so cute i'm gonna try to get through all these without boring you guys because there's about i offer 16 different styles of mink lashes um so just some um, if you you know hopefully you'll want to keep watching so that if you see one that you like instead of me boring you <laughs> So these are Dreamer. Dreamer is a luxury lash. So it definitely, um, actually it looks very 3D. Like there is, it's very, very, very wispy. God given, how pretty is she? They, I'm okay, you got that. <laughs> <laughs> so god given is has literally little chunks put together these look amazing on amazing okay so angel is so pretty because she's very soft in the front and then she starts to wisp out slowly and go a little bit fuller in the corner Angel. Savior is one of our 3D lashes. And this one actually is a huge, huge seller. Very full, very thick, super gorgeous, darling, super gorgeous. Watch Me um, is a very, very similar concept to the other one. However, the fullness starts a little bit closer. So they're very soft and then they're in the corner they give you that really nice cat eye because they give you that all the lash in the corner effect so there's watch me purpose is one of our 3d lashes and she is um, she starts off a little softer and gets really wispy and full in the corners Blessed. Blessed is one of my softest lashes that I carry. She's a mink lash and it, she goes good for anybody who doesn't want too much going on but they want that extra just little pop. So it's a very common lash. Soft and pretty for every day. Faithful is a little bit fuller and she does have a little wing out in the corner. She is a mink lash. You can wear her. I've worn this one before over 15 times and she's still going strong because I love Faithful for like every day. A lot of my brides use it too. Bang is very different. 
Bang is very wispy with spaces. So anybody who likes a very wispy but um, just a lash that is going to stand out a little bit, which I know these are a big seller right now because people are liking the very wispy with little gaps um, and then just little I'm trying to figure out where to put them because there's so many this little table so gracious is a little bit longer um, with a full 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 ends right there you can see it I wanted to offer a lot of these because I feel like they're so different. A lot of lashes just are kind of uniform and they kind of stay the same all the way through where my lashes, sometimes they start off soft and they go really full or they start off soft and then get fuller in the center. And then there's ones that start off soft and go super full in the corner. So I just wanted to offer you guys different options of lashes and just, you know, expressing yourself in different ways. So these are heavenly. Heavenly, I feel like is a very um, soft lash and you can almost do Heavenly every day if you wanted to. But she still has like a lot of um, fullness to her. Now, God Fearing is probably right now one of the biggest sellers. She is very, very, very full and she starts off light and wings out um, a lot. She is a 3D lash and she has a different dimension. Um, the way that the minks are together they're kind of they kind of go this way and come up almost like a little cross and come up so it gives it a different effect especially on your eye which is so gorgeous how pretty are those now date with destiny is what i have on right now i'm wearing these boobs She is a really pretty everyday lash. I just love her. She's full. She does have a little, um, they curl up, which is what I like about these ones. They curl up really good and they have a little, little extra drama in the corner without being too much. Like on a day that you just want to be a little softer, but you want your eyelashes to make a statement. They're awesome. So Inspire uh, is more of a center longer. So there are people who have a different shape eye and want to bring out the center of their eye rather than having the wing in the corner. So Inspire would definitely bang. You can also use bang that's more of a center lash rather than a lash that gets fuller in the corner, which is the same thing with Inspire. Inspire um, is just shorter right here and I think a tiny bit shorter here, but the main focus is right here, the center of the eye. So it kind of just gives your eye a fuller look for people who want their eye to look a little bit more open rather than having the almond shape and they want to open it up a little bit more. So Inspire is awesome for that. So you can see it, she is more of a center full lash. And Image is really pretty. Um, she goes a little shorter, but then comes to a natural, but more naturally. She doesn't um, come out too long in the corner, just like a natural lash would. And that is all of them, guys. I got through it. Yay! Boxes. And if you guys have any questions at all, you can definitely um, send me messages on here. You can send me messages on Instagram and you can also send me messages um, at info at Makeup by Angels Cosmetics. To order any products that you like, you can go to MakeupByAngelsCosmetics.com. There are pictures on there. I do recommend for you to go to the swatches on the Instagram page, which the Instagram page is just Jessica Makeup by... No, no, no. That's my regular Instagram page. <laughs> Uh, the Instagram cosmetic page is Makeup by Angels Cosmetics and you can go on there and get any swatches that you want to see. Uh, I do take a lot of swatches in light and in dark so you can see it. Just keep in mind that I do have a, a deeper complexion um, than some people because I'm Latina and um, just keep that in mind. So the colors will vary a little bit according to skin color and your pigmentation and things like that. So... And I think if there's anything else, because I only get a little bit of time to talk to you guys before they cut me off. 
yeah no i think i think that's it i mean i hope you guys love this line i've been working on it for so long and i could not wait to share it with you guys and i'm so excited that it's finally here i did open it up internationally so you can order internationally now it was originally just in the usa but because of high demands of um, people emailing me to open it up i did open it up so i'm so excited about that and um I'm very excited that the people in a lot of other countries are wearing the products and I hope you guys really, really love it. Um, and I think that's pretty much it. I did want to address another issue because I have been getting um, some people in um, another country that are saying that somebody has the same packaging of my lipstick cases, nothing else. Um, a lot of it was came from different companies. Um, I went to packaging shows, picked out my designs and things like that. Um, and because my line was called Elegance with No Boundaries, which was very strong for me, um, for my collection, I actually went with this uh, lipstick container. Um, I was choosing between a lot of different containers, but this one actually spoke to me a little bit more. And a lot of my clients seem to like it because I let some of my clients, like you know, test some of my st stuff out beforehand, and. This was a big one, so I went by popular demands of just people around me and seeing what they liked. And so I hear that there's another company in Korea that has a similar packaging to mine. Um, when I looked it up, it's very, very similar. I believe they're just not gold, so like my whole inside, my whole casing, everything like that is gold. Um, so, um, but you know... <sighs> At the same time, they're completely different formulas. I reached out to the company. They are no longer carrying this and they will no longer carry it. So I am permanently the only one right now to carry this product. If somebody should launch it in the future, then you know I wish them the best as well because every product inside is different and everybody has a different vision for what they're looking for. And this was just my vision that came to life and I created. So. That being said, I hope you love them and I will see you guys soon.